This video is dedicated to those users of the Superior Drummer 2.0 who are wondering uh, how the EasyX expansions work with the Superior Drummer. I was personally faced with this question when I, when I was uh, browsing through a TuneTrack site. I couldn't find any info information whatsoever on how the EasyX drummers, uh, the EasyX expansions, w would uh, actually work with the Superior Drummer 2.0. This video is dedicated to answering that question. So I got the Metal Machine EZX uh, and Superior Drummer, and now I'll go, we'll go through some of the most important features of the Superior Drummer uh, and see whether or not they actually work with this uh, expansion pack. Okay, here we have a Superior Drummer loaded up, and let's let's pull out the Metal Machine. Easy X. So uh, of course you immediately notice that the interface is quite different from uh, what what you would have with Easy Drummer, but uh, this uh, this uh, obviously shouldn't be a problem. So um, let's start going through the features then. Yeah. So of course you can select between classic and standard view, and um, here you can select the kits. Uh, with the metal machine, you have uh, four uh, options there for tool set settings. Uh, metal machine doesn't have any other than s stick, so this is why we can't select any here. Uh, the X drum uh, feature, where you can import uh, dr uh, dr drums between libraries, uh, works just just normally, which is which is great. I can choose. For example, uh, a new snare from here, and um, of course the microphone assignment works just uh, A-OK. -okay. Uh, then the envelope filter, uh, it, it also wor works just like in uh, Superior Drummer. So the envelope uh, designer works just just okay, and um, then the pitch uh, pitch control feature. Let's let's try. Yeah, it works just just okay. And um, how about this? So it works. Uh, now, now the humanize options um, they seem to work, but uh, of course I don't. I, I can't really tell what they are actually doing in the sample pool. So uh, I just, just assume that they work just like in in or how they would work in Easy Drummer. Uh, and then for the uh, uh, memory and status bar, uh, you can select in theory between. Uh, 16 and 24 bit, but um, since the total size isn't changing, I'm assuming that it actually doesn't do anything. <laughs> um, from here, you can uh, access the um, the mixer presets, just like you would uh, have in in uh, Easy Drummer. You can choose between these ones, and okay, master volume of course works. Um, and then the voice and layer options. I'm not really sure uh, how the, how this really works. Uh, you can, of course, choose between a large and medium and so on, and, and choose this. But um, I don't know how it would actually affect this. So I don't really know. Just just that this is a, a question mark. <laughs> um, for the instrument options here, of course, the most important is the mod multiple hit emulation. Yeah, I don't think it actually does anything. So, so that's that's a, a question mark also. Okay, now for the um, okay now for the mixer view. 
uh, features. First, the ch channel preset. You can load these uh, uh, effect uh, effects uh, presets just like in, in the uh, Superior Drummer libraries, and you and you can add your own uh, insert effects. Let, let's let's try something on the. Uh, Let's actually try something on maybe the snare drum. Let's put on some th something here. Okay. So let's say we wanted to alter the uh, snare drum. Perhaps the top microphone. Let's put an EQ there. Yeah. Yeah, it does seem to work. Great. Okay, and the bus send, where you can uh, uh, send uh, these channels to certain buses here, that works too. You can just click click from there and so on. Uh, okay, and then the bleed controls. Uh, they wo they work just like uh, in the uh, Superior Drummer ex uh, expansion and all the libraries, but but of course uh, with the um, the uh, Easy Drummer libraries, you don't get so many uh, bleed samples. For example, in 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 snare drum top, uh, I believe you don't have uh, so many bleeds. Yes. So now, now you can see we don't actually get any bleed samples on, on, on this track. But, um, but for example in this one you can uh, maybe if you want the snare out. Yeah. And the kick. On. So thus you, you can do, do uh, all the things that uh, you could do to the bleed samples in, in, the, uh, in the other other libraries, but the amount of samples that you have is very limited. <laughs> um, then, the, uh, then the fade and the pan, they work just normally. Let's, let's put on something. For example this. Yeah. Yeah. So these work normally, and of course these faders work normally. The solo and the mute buttons work normally, and the and, uh, and the phase button also works normally. Um, of course, the multi-out feature is available just normally. And you can route this any any way you would you you would want, just like in, just like you would expect it to work. And that's for all for this window, I think. Then the grooves or the the MIDI grooves. Here I have the metal machine grooves, just like you would expect. You can select the just the normal uh, kit pieces individually. Like this, yeah. So that works too. Mapping works uh, normally. You can um, you can select the uh, the uh, the samples here and drag them to wherever you want. So that works normally. Uh, the bounce features also work normally. So nothing f fancy there, and uh, of course you don't have anything of interest here, really. So uh, that's all I think. Okay, so what we can deduce from this brief review is that um, for the most part you can use all the features uh, that was um, that that was in Superior Drummer 
but of course with the limit of which samples you are given in the uh, expansion library, usually with uh, uh, e uh, EZX lib uh, expansion libraries you don't get so many bleed samples for example so then, then you would just have no bleed samples available for most of the channels. You can ho however apply all the effects that you want, EQ, compression and um, and alter the pitch of the instruments which, it, which of course is a nice feature and um, hmm, I, 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 I guess I should have answered the original original question now yeah okay thank you for watching and uh, see you next time